What am I doing? I'm making a video about dolls. How can I make this a little more manly? Now that's better. Yep, we're making a video about dolls. Here in the toy cave, we don't discriminate. Specifically, we're talking about Strawberry Shortcake, a toy line by Kenner, yes, that Kenner, the maker of the vintage Star Wars line. The Strawberry Shortcake line ran from 1979 to 1985. And last week, I was at some garage sales and I happened upon two gallon Ziploc bags full of strawberry shortcake dolls. They were priced at $2 a bag, so everything you're about to see was purchased for only $4. This garage sale happened at the perfect time because it was only two days away from Mother's Day and I hadn't picked up a gift for my wife yet. So whenever we go toy hunting, my wife has to look at all the strawberry shortcake dolls. She didn't really have many strawberry shortcake as a child, but her cousin had all of them. And she was super jealous because her cousin wouldn't let her play with her strawberry shortcake dolls. So she kind of has this fascination with them because she never got to play with them. So I thought this would be the perfect gift for her for Mother's Day. We're going to look at the dolls one at a time. And of course, we're starting here with strawberry shortcake. This strawberry shortcake is the second release. You can tell because her hands are shaped to grip things. The early release just had flat palms out hands. So here she is. She's complete with her shoes, her tights, her dress, and her hat. And the second release came with pets. So this is Custard Cat. Up next we have Huckleberry Pie. He's the only male character that is not a baby. This is also the second release of the figure with the gripping hands from 1982. And he is complete with his hat, his overalls, his shoes, and also his dog, Pupcake the dog. Here is Angel Cake with her skunk, Souffle. She has her shoes, her tights, and her dress, but she is missing her tiara slash halo that she came with. And when we look at some other dolls, we'll notice how thin and cheap Kenner made their hair. But with this one, since it didn't really have a hat to cover the head, you can tell they made the hair a lot thicker. This is Lemon Meringue. She's got her shoes, her tights, her dress, and her hat. And her hair is still nice and curly. I am missing her pet. Up next, we have Lime Chiffon and Parfait Parrot. Well, she's not complete. We've got her shoes. This one's cracked and some tights, but she doesn't have her dress or her hat. And over here, Parfait Parrot's got something you may know if you're a Kenner Star Wars collector. See all those dark spots? That's some plastic mold from the Hong Kong factory. That's impossible to get out and is very common with these old Kenner plastics. Even less complete, we have Apple Dumpling here with Tea Time Turtle. All I've got for her is a sock. And then there's Tea Time Turtle. Just look at those derpy eyes. And here we have Apricot and her bunny hops a lot. Um, she's missing her little booties. Next we have another one of the babies. This is Cherry Cuddler and Gooseberry Goose. I don't care for these names. Here's some more babies. These two came in a two pack. This one is a boy named Lem. This is a girl named Ada, so together they're Laminata. Get it? Hopefully YouTube doesn't flag us for nudity on this one, but this is Cafe Olay from the International Doll series where they came from other countries. She is supposed to be the Mexican doll. All we've got for her are her sandals. And she hails from the country of Mexico. Ugh. This one is from the later 1984 series that was called Party Pleasers, where they all had a birthday party theme, so their pet was dressed up for a party. This one is sitting because I don't have her shoes, and they're impossible to stand up without their shoes. Here is the villain of Strawberry Shortcake. Did you know they have a villain? 
This is Purple Pie Man and his bird, Berry Bird. Uh, we're missing all of his clothes, but we do have the bird. This guy is huge. He absolutely towers over Strawberry Shortcake. And man, is he creepy. This one's missing his mustache as well, which makes him extra creepy. Here are the clothes from some mysteriously missing Strawberry Shortcake dolls. I wonder if Purple Pie Man ate them, or God knows what. But here we have from the character Butter Cookie, her hat, and Jelly Bear. Here we have Raspberry Tart's hat, dress, and shoes. And here we have the Butterfly Marmalade for Orange Blossom, plus her hat, her dress, her tights, and her shoes. But where are they? And here are some other accessories that were in the bag. This is the horse Maple Stirrup. She came with a vehicle called the Oatsmobile. And we also have her brush. And in the back here we have the Berry Cycle. It's missing the seat. This table and chair come from a place that called the Garden House, which is like a gazebo. And then we have one of the uh, berry fashions. This is a raincoat from the set Berry Rainy Day. And one of the rain boots. And here's the sleeping hat from the outfit called Berry Sleepy. Can you believe I got that whole collection of strawberry shortcake for $4 at a rummage sale? My wife was very happy to receive these on Mother's Day. Finally, she has some strawberry shortcakes to call her own. In your face, Mandy! I hope you enjoyed this video. Not something I ever thought I'd be talking about on this channel. But don't forget to like and subscribe. Don't worry, I got manly stuff.